saw what happened last night and an expert at U of L. Steve. Vicki, the woman was driving down a dark interstate highway. She said it was a little bit scary. The expert at the planetarium on the University of Louisville campus says it was much smaller than you might think. A lot of people from eastern Kentucky to uh, well into Illinois and Indiana saw this one and heard it. And this is what they witnessed, a meteor streaking across the sky. This security camera video came from Steve Hart of Cincinnati. To create a sonic boom, the meteor would at least be the size of a baseball. Conservative estimates are nearly 100,000 tons of meteorites hit our planet every day. 75% of those are lost in the oceans. Uh, most of those are the size of a grain of rice or something very, very small. When I saw it, it did not cross my mind that it was a meteor. Kelly Ritter was driving back to Louisville from Evansville. The sky got freakishly bright. I didn't see it until I looked out the window and saw it burn out. So it was just like a giant ball of fire. But initially, it was kind of terrifying for a minute, yeah. <laughs> At first, Ritter thought it was fireworks until she saw the video. I saw the timestamp on the video, and I was like, that's what I saw. Oh, my God, and I freaked out. Just over about the last 11 days, there has been nearly 500 reports of bright uh, shooting stars or fireballs in the sky. U of L has a tiny sample of what has fallen and survived entering the atmosphere. This large piece fell in Argentina in the 1500s. We've had two meteor showers this month. It's been a busy time the last couple of days, Un unusually busy. I didn't hear it or feel it, but I saw it. It was pretty cool. Now, according to Drew Foster at U of L, the overnight fireball reportedly was as bright as a full moon. Steve Bergen, WLKY News.